Hey guys, welcome back to a new video and today I'm doing painting plus slime and um, I've actually got my slime right here but that's going over in the corner right now and I'm actually painting if you want proof it's in the formula and also here's my paintbrush and here's my paints and these paints are water paints these are from these are from as that and it's a paint palette and i actually don't know how much they were i think it was like a pound or two definitely not less than a pound and um they are really actually quite good i would show you some artwork i've already done with it but i've got to go all the way in there to get it but i will do it Don't want things clashing. There we go. So um, I'm back, and um, I've got a school project to do on dance, and it's to do with Greek gods. And I've done a front page. There's probably a little bit more I can do to it, but I'm not doing it right now because I've just done it. And my god, god was Apollo, and this is what I have done. I've done this with the paints, so obviously as you can tell I've got Apollo, got his bow, got the son of Zeus and the Zeus's lone bolt, and then mother is whatever her name is, I don't know. I put a love heart there because it symbols the love between the mother and the father and the son together. So that is my little piece, it's on a nice little bit of card. Um, that's what I have done with my paint. I've done a few more things, but that was just to try them out, so it don't really matter. And um, I'm going to be painting with, obviously, those paints. I've got pencil, rubber, some paper, a cup of water, paintbrush, and a little booklet, which is um, Katmadu one, because we and my school may win a cute little uh, trip to Katmadu in Spain. And um, Gave us a nice little booklet which I can paint on, which I thought might be nice, a little painting book, which would be maybe cute. So I'm going to actually set you up to see what I'm doing, so let's do that. It may have a pop socket down though, mate, innit? Right, yeah. Right, let's try set this up the best I can. This may be very tricky as I have got my phone on charge. There you go, you can now see what I'm doing. I've got to move my chair a little bit so it's not banging against things. So now you can see my, my page. I'm going to start right on here, but first what I'm going to do is I'm going to wet the black. You guys are probably so confused on why I'm wetting black, but you'll soon find out. So right now I'm going to go. Y T Y T Art Book There we go. Hopefully this dr will dry. Wash off that paint brush and let's blow it. It's literally almost dry straight away, which is great. Oh god, there you go. So now we're gonna go on to this page. And we're going to draw like this today. So today I think I'm going to draw a cute little garden. So let's start off with some brown first. So let's wet the brown. Right, let's see how that is. That 
actually fine. And let's go straight in. This is the only paintbrush I have, by the way, guys. So, move this a bit further up there so you can see what I'm doing for a minute. Wet the paintbrush, get some more paint. If you guys haven't noticed already, I do really like doing art, so, and I have just done three live streams in a row, which isn't actually bad because it means I'm, at least I'm producing videos for you guys, and I also uploaded another video, so I am very, I am very getting into producing a lot of cute videos, slime, painting, talking, makeup, body art, makeup, um, doing that background thing that I still have not finished but I do that on my mum's and uh, I'm going to do a lot of things for you guys and I'm going to do, start doing dares uh, when I have my special guest rounds so hopefully we'll be having special guest rounds soon I don't know exactly when but hopefully we'll have one and it would be nice for Christmas for me to get a camera so I can start doing vlogs so hopefully they'll be coming up soon Otherwise, if I do vlogs, they will literally be live streams of a day, like every 10 minutes when I want to film. You guys are probably really wondering why I'm doing this very long. I don't know myself. I'm not really like an artist, but my nan and my granddad are artists. If you're wondering why I'm bringing them up, they are very good artists. And I'm actually seeing them tomorrow, so I hope they can teach me a few art things. And um, that would be really nice to be taught a few art things. And then I can bring them on to doing a lot of things. I, can, I know I do art in like school and everything, but my nan and granddad are like really good at art. So. And I will never ever say anything horrible about that art. Because to be honest, even if you don't like it, you still will say wow. Because it is quite impressive what they do. So... No one can ever say, um, I don't like that to my and granddad's are because it's just too good. Just making this bit a little bit darker now. So we've done the lovely now like bomb bit. We just need to put a little bit of green layer on the top. Just a little bit. Literally, when I say a little bit, I really do mean. I get told in school all the time I'm a real good artist. At a young age, people think that I'm good, like doing things like this, or good artist. But there's someone in my school that is amazing at art, and I forget which form she's in, but she is an amazing artist. Like, amazing. She produces a 18 year old piece of work. Now, that says something about her artwork, doesn't it? Here we go, the green layer's down. So we've got a muddy layer, we've got a green layer, and we're just going to wet that. I know wetting it isn't actually the greatest thing to do, but I'm trying to smooth it out a bit more. So it doesn't look like actual streaks. And I always go and check the next page and make sure it isn't too wet. Let's make sure that's all the paint off my brush. Okay. So now we're going to go in with, I think I'm going to try and make a ref, I'm, I'm not going to show you guys what I'm doing right now, but I'm literally just putting water on a piece of paper that I have near me, 
getting a bit of green and putting that into the water and like making it green obviously and then I'm going to add but get the white wet and add some white to it to hopefully make a baby green and a different colour green yes it's more of a mint green and that is my favourite colour so here we go hopefully it comes out nicely Ooh, that came out very different as you can probably tell and let's get a little bit more there we go yeah you can just see that lightly <laughs> there we go That's nice. Uh. There we go. Hopefully you guys are enjoying this art. Hope you are. Because this is actually not that easy, let's be honest. And we are actually going to make this to dry. Oop, not dry yet. It's looking really nice. I'm really liking this. We're le we're twelve minutes into this video. Twelve minutes in, and this is my produced product. And um, we're going to go get some yellow. Okay. So we've got some yellow. We're going to go round the bell here and do a small dot. There we go. Rinse my brush. And blew that. I'm just going to spread it out a bit more to, oh really, I'm just going to take a bit away, that isn't dry, but obviously we want it to dry as quick as we can. Okay, it's basically dry now, so we're going to grab some red. I'm gonna get some water on the red. And it is a bit too watery, so what we're gonna do is dry off our brush and go back in, and we should have a nice bit. Okay, so we're going to make sure we have a very sharp brush over there. We're going to go basically like the leaf shape we did earlier. But this is very hard with a uh, paintbrush. Especially when you're not an artist. Let's just say that much. Okay, last one because a flower should have five petals. Okay, there's our flower and the yellow bit in the middle. Let's rinse our brush and we have a, um, I would want to make a purple so we're going to get water again on the on this little bit. I would show you this but my phone's on charge and it's really hard to do that. We're going to get some red, I'm going to put that in there, a bit more red. I'm going to get some blue. Hopefully this will make a nice purple. Okay, we've got like a dark purple right now. More red. 
add some white. Add some white and you've got a lovely purple colour. Let me just do that. Look how nice that purple is. It looks a bit, it's probably going to look a bit weird on camera, but it looks really nice in person. So, what we're going to do is do a smaller, basically like a leaf shape in the middle of the flower. And I'm going to colour that in purple. There we go. There's one done. And I'm just going to quickly do them. If it's off camera, I'm very sorry, but it's very hard to make sure everything's in camera while trying to paint with things in your way. I don't know how much you can see right now. There we go, and we're going to go right back in with some red and go right on the outside of that purple. I wish this purple was dry. Oh, we've got to save that purple as quick as we can. Right, let's dry this. I'm a bit scared right now. Okay. We're going to wait for that, all this, to dry right now because this is getting too much. Got to make sure the purple's dry before we add the red. It's a little bit bonkers. And we've also got to make sure. That the red is not very watery. There we go. This is literally turned into being a pain. There we go. Wow, that was an actual pain. There's a bit of the flower. Oh, that was really hard though, is all I'm saying. Okay, that is not dry. Let's get rid of that. Wet the blue. Let's get some water on the, the table first because we're going to make some light blue and we need quite a lot of water for that because we're going to need a lot of it. We're going to make a lot. We're going to make sure there's a lot of blue in this. Ok, 
Okay. Now I'm going to make sure the blue's off. And now I'm going to get a lot of white. And we're going to add that in. And hopefully this will make a really nice light blue. Oh, sky blue. On. That's really the colour I'm going for. So we're going to add in a bit more white. Oh, we're getting to the sky blue and want add a bit more white and in a minute I'm going to add some more water to make some more of this once I've got my colour sorted yeah I've got my colour sorted more water And now we're going to go in and paint. This is not looking blue. I understand that. So maybe I'll add a bit more blue into the colour I just made. Because otherwise it's not very white, was it? That's much better actually I think I'm just gonna literally just go in with a blue because that's blue that is not and as you may be able to tell yes I am making the sky go around the flower I understand this look green <laughs> but trust me it's really not and I don't have to get the flash on so we're gonna have to survive with what what the clue you've got right now I've almost been painting this just this simple thing for half an hour. I have been making colours and things like that, but jeez, I thought I would have been on the next one by now. I don't even know if I'm going to do a next one at this rate. I literally am trying to think of someone's name but I cannot that is how bad I am right now with names let me just finish this off quickly gotta get I need to get a bit more here There we go. Painting is done. Let's. There we go. If you were wondering what stand you want, it was that. Right up here. Could you stand on that? But look how far down you'd be. You wouldn't be able to see anything really. But there you go. I think it looks really cute. It is very like people would say to me but to me there we go 
it is absolutely fine. First page of the art book, the YouTube art book, is flower. Okay. <sighs> Gotta make sure that dries. If you want to look at what colour the um, paint water is, it has gone purple. When I first tried out the paints, it went like a very nice strawberry milkshake colour and I was like, do you want some milkshake? But no, no, no. No way do we want milkshake. So, while we're going for the really wet bits to dry, I'm going to put that over there. I'm going to start playing with the slime I chose in my last video to be my favourite. And this one is the one I chose not to be. So, yeah. This is very much lagging. Because, look. Why are you laggy? As you can tell, there are no balls at the bottom. Which means I may leave this for a little bit longer and play with the one I chose to not be my favourite. Because that means the balls will go to them up to the top. The one I chose to not be my favourite is right here. And you can go see why in the video called My Review and Comparing. And I think the thumbnail is of this. I can't remember what the thumbnail is. I think it's like that. Something like this. I can't, I can't remember. But yeah. It was like half an hour ago. That. This is a very farty slime. This is also from Tiger. I think the more you play with it, the more it actually turns into slime. Collins Key, weird view comedy. Okay, Collins Key just uploaded. Okay, we're gonna have to tip this out. <laughs> okay, and we're gonna put it back in. Literally so sloppy that there's so many air bubbles. So I'm press down. There we go. Can we get any more? No. What? There's some. Oh, a little bit. Know what's going on? There we go. Got very farty slime, eh? Out and boom. There we go. I'm getting it now. You can see every, when you see it. See, you can see it vibrating. Mmm, it's very, very not nice. It's very unpleasant. But this is very beautiful slime. I have to say it's very beautiful. My colours, does that smell nice? My colours are fully mixed in. Okay. Gotta make it thick. And you gotta drop it in and push it and press it and press it. And yep. And in. sound oh dropping it farty slime eh well we're gonna bring this back because I'm pretty sure this will be dry it is dry so here's our dry finished piece and um, I'm gonna quickly go on to the next the next page I'm going to write something
You just don't know that. See, this person is probably so confused why. annoys me though for doing things like this One last bit. <sighs> Are you going to be ready for the result? I just drawed, basically. Hopefully my teacher likes my project I've done. I'm not finished yet. But I have spent quite a bit of time on it. Like, Miss has to. If she says that, you're good enough. I'll be like, I brought paint, I painted, I writ, I've got paper. And you say that ain't enough. What is wrong with this DJ? And it's officially dry, and this is my finished project. Bang! The LJ Club, which is what all of you lovely subscribers, people that are watching, and if you want to be part of the LJ Club, subscribe. That is what all of you are, the LJ Club, and if you subscribe now, be, you'll be a part of this. Why is Tom texting me? Tom Snapchatted me. No idea why, but there we go. That is a, this is a really good book so far, so... This, I'm going to show you the book, so when you get, if you ever, when I open the book, this is what I get before I open it, I obviously have to undo it, and I open it to this page, and I have a um, YouTube art book with a little love heart, then I have a lovely picture of a like garden kind of, then if I go on to the next one, I have the best warm so right now is the LJ Club. So we will be going on with these soon, hopefully, which would be nice too. And I'm going to, in a minute, show you the result of what I've done and what I'm kind of made. So this is the mess up so far. We're going to add the mess and colours there. Which may just be a mess. Hope I don't get killed for it. I'm sure I'll, I'm sure I won't. But I'll tidy that up in a bit. And I've actually got to show you this slime, haven't I? This malicious slime. So let's get you set up for that. Hello, who is ever on my live stream? Please, may you tell me who you are? Goodbye, then, whoever you are. So, let's move this a bit more so you can only. because you can't see the way. Bad annoying, see, it's bad annoying you can see this, but who cares? So, here's the slime. I think it would be better if you couldn't. Who really cares? So, no little foam beads at the bottom here. And they're all coming up to the top, and I feel like they're far enough up. Far enough up to poke. So let's open. There we are, and we have a few air bubbles, so. Let's 
to got rid of the air bubbles and let's see see that big one there look at that big nice foam it won't focus there we go it's focusing now if you want it to focus you have to do this make it the only thing it can focus on Let's go. Now we've done that, we're gonna have a look at the bottom. Boom, bubble, bubble, mm. foam, bubble, foam beads there now. More. do is completely mix it. It would be nice to get the bubbles out and play with just the foam beads out and play with just the slime but the slime would be very sticky without them so very hard to swirl this layer. Look, it's that sticky, sometimes it sticks to your finger. And the whole thing comes out, so you need to like make sure it won't. If it's possible, because look, I'm literally just doing like the most little taps. There we go. This is one reason it annoys me, is it can be really sticky. If we try to get the slime off my finger, we'll do that now. I actually have a announcement I guess you could call it and basically the announcement is we have a new goal a new goal about a week ago I would say now or oh, almost a week ago we hit 30 subscribers now that was our goal for about two months to hit 30 subscribers as soon as we hit like 2015 and um we've got there but now what we've got to do is get a new goal and i don't know where to set our goal at i don't know if we can go give it to the highest level give it to the highest level the medium level and the in between level and the lowest. The lowest. I don't want to say what the lowest is. The in between, we literally in between of the lowest and the middle. And then we have the highest, which is the goal that most people, I think, like Tom, Tom Star and 06 has set. So I'm not really sure to try the um because I want to start getting a little race between me and him um i don't know where to set it so let's just think i'll tell you where the levels are set our lowest one is set at um 35 is our low one the in between is actually 37 37 so that's in between it's 37 
And then our middle one we have is 40. I don't want to say this. Or can hear numbers around. Um, so let's go 35, 40, 40, yeah. So we've got 35 is our lowest, 40 is our in between, 45 is our middle, and our high one is 50. And that's the high one, which is 50, is where I think Tom has set his. maybe next video i will set it but right now we can think about our levels we have and those levels we'll think about i'll also ask tom where he's setting his next goal out to be and if his is like 40 we're going for the ultimate level or the middle level because if he's at 40 he's at the he's at the in between level so me and tom now have our levels to work up and our levels to choose from so tom if you ever see this this these levels are real these levels go lowest 35 because we're both at 30 then in between is 40 middle is 45 and the highest is 50 so tom make sure you have that make sure you write it down because i'm going to do that and i'm going to write in my art book my youtube art book this is a good notebook for it so we're going to put um out goals um with tom so we have low which is 35, I'm going to put more than current, 30, then in between, in between is 40, middle, 45, and the highest is 50 so I've written that down that is very important for me because I will tick the next goal we have and I don't know to go for a low one and work our way up or just to talk to Tom and see what his is so I'm going to go do that after this video this is literally business I do business all the time I don't have my computer with me so I can't really do a lot of business which is very but who cares? Right now, I'm doing up business so I can. What do we? So I'm gonna go, guys, and I'm gonna sort this goal thing out, and I'll talk to you about it later. So see you later, guys. Bye. Boop.